I was on Twitter when the news of Satori Iwata's passing spread around, and I saw Artsy Omni make a post suggesting that maybe we could do something to raise money for charity, and in regards of a shirt being sold to people. Now, as soon as I saw the shirt's concept, at least the first draft of it, I knew for a fact that I had to get on board with this. So, the video that I'm bringing you guys today is to bring your awareness to a shirt that we are selling together, although Artsy Omni did do most of the artwork, <laughs> in fact, he did most of the work in general. He set up the campaign, he designed the art for the shirt, but I'm here as well to show it to you guys so that way you can be aware that there's a lot of ways that you can show your support for Satoru Iwata. Now, I actually have the first draft of the shirt right here, but I didn't want to show it off too much to you guys because this isn't exactly the one that we're going to be seeing today, but um, this was kind of like a prototype that was done before the final version, and you guys are going to be able to see the final version right now, actually. That's the campaign right there. Of course, as usual, everything will be linked in the description so you can find all the stuff for yourself. But yeah, I had like a first design made. Some of you might have seen this from um, Evo when I was there and other places as well too. But this isn't the one that we're focusing on today. This is just like a concept. The main thing that I want to bring you guys' attention to is the campaign, however. Now, RT Omni and I, like I said, we are teaming up to bring this to you dudes. And we feel like this is a great way to show support in two manners. So the first one, to be able to showcase, you know, just to be able to showcase your, your your sympathies for Satori Iwata, this is a thank you, Mr. Iwata shirt. And it's a bit more respectful than the one I have, which just says, thank you, Iwata. Um, I, I like the direction that Artsy Omni went with the new one, but you can use this to be able to really show your, I don't know, I don't want to put it in a way that makes it seem as if this is, just to like wear it like a badge or something but i don't know about you guys when when i heard the news i was i was fucking devastated dude and i know i'm using I'm, I'm some foul language to be using in a video like this but it emphasizes the exact feeling that i had at that moment and i'm not just saying i'm the only one i know a lot of you guys were as well too and i needed something some kind of way to be able to show respect and show tribute and honor the legacy of satori iwata and how he affected all of our childhoods in one way or another I think this is a great way to do so. So as you guys can see here, the um, the most previous design looks really good actually, and it even has something on the back as well too, which is a controller with the at and a heart. And then also some more details about this. Um, just gonna check out the page really quick. I'll run through the description with you guys. A shirt dedicated to the memory of Satoru Iwata, who led Nintendo as its president from 2002 to 2015. However, he was with the company far longer than that. 50% of the proceeds will be donated to Child's Play to benefit children's in, children in hospitals, excuse me, and the other 50% will go to ch cancer research. Now, when we first put together the campaign, we had a little bit of difficulty in deciding on what cancer research society that we would donate the money to, the other 50% of the proceeds, and we recently found something. Don't eviscerate me for trying to pronounce this, but this will also be in the description as well, too. Um, the... <laughs> Yeah, you guys know pronunciation isn't exactly my strong suit when it comes to um, words like this, but this will be linked in the description. This cancer research facility dedicates all of its efforts to being able to prevent bile duct cancer, which is what Satori Iwata passed away from. And we feel like this will be the best place to put the money towards, simply because it supports the exact thing that sadly ended um, Satori Iwata's life, but also to be able to make this not be something that can hurt anyone anymore. Uh, only 2,000 people per year in the United States are affected by this condition, so it is relatively rare, but I feel like the society is definitely doing their thing. Um, let's head back to the campaign, though. So as you guys can see here, you can purchase the shirt for $17, and like we said, none of this is going into our own pockets here. Artie Omni and I, we're not, we're not using this on our own regards or any personal benefit. This is entirely for charity. And I know a lot of you dudes most likely have seen this for yourselves as well too. And if you already have purchased a shirt from it, then by all means, I'm grateful for it. As soon as your shirts come in, let me know on Twitter so that way I can retweet you. There's three days, 14 hours, 25 minutes, and 31 seconds left in the campaign until it ends. The shirts are already going to be printed at this point. So there's not too much time if you really want to jump in on this. The campaign won't be able to last forever. Once it's closed, it won't be able to be open again if a lot of you guys know how Teespring works. And so far, 958 of these shirts were sold. So already, that's easily over $10,000 that we have available, I believe. 
um, you know, over 10,000 easily to be able to give to Child's Play and to the cancer research facilities that we specified. You will probably have to pay for shipping at some point for this, but for the most part, everything else is going to go to, for charity. The only money that wouldn't go to charity is the shipping amount. So if you really want to show your support for Iwata in more ways than one, then I think this shirt is the best way to do it. And plus, on top of it all, the main reason why I got this shirt early is because I just wanted to wear something to, to honor Satoru Iwata's legacy while I was at E3. And, you know, even though this was the first um, prototype, I still feel like I was able to do that well. And I'm glad that I was able to showcase this to other people because a lot of people were asking me, Etika, where'd you get that shirt at, man? You know, like, I want, I want to know what's going on with it. Well, not only will you be able to get the shirt to also show your support for Satoru Iwata and Nintendo, but you'll be able to help save some lives as well, too. And I feel like at the end of the day, that's the main focus of this campaign. Not necessarily for the shirts, but just to be able to help those who are also suffering from the same conditions and to be able to hopefully save a life one day. And I feel like this campaign will make us a bit closer to that goal. Anyways, guys, thank you so much for tuning in. And I really hope you do decide to support the campaign. It's kind of... Um, it's kind of hitting me a little bit hard while I talk about it, but I mean, I'm really hoping you guys will be able to show some support. I know I know, I, I usually don't ask you guys to do things like this. I mean, I know a lot of you dudes don't really have the money to, but if you can support it, if you can, then by all means, definitely feel free to do so. You'll get a nice memoir of Satori Wada while at the same time really pushing forward in a goal to um, end bile duct cancer. All right, guys, I'll talk to you in the next video thank you so much for tuning in take care of yourselves and of course as usual please have yourself a damn good one